It won't come as a surprise to hear that a career horseman has called to the post as his ringtone. What's so funny about it is when John Soto hears this, he knows a Budweiser Clydesdale foal is about to enter the world. A midwife, that's the easiest way to explain it. I'm, 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 a, I'm a professional midwife. <laughs> and horse dating service. For 35 years, he's been playing the ponies by matching stallions with mares, hoping to come up with this. Clydesdales that match the Budweiser standard of white face, four white legs, and beautiful bay color. We try to look a mare and a, a stallion and think, okay, what is that baby gonna look like? Is it gonna look like what we want? So, and that's where we, that's where we go from. So it's a lot of fun. So you can just kind of look around a pasture and know which ones you brought into this world? Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. And while Mother Nature does most of the work, this supervisor of Warm Springs Ranch has some interesting technology that helps. It's called a, a, a foal alert. Everything's attached to the mare. And then as the, everything starts to expand, this magnet comes out, sets the alarm off. Then this auto dialer on top of it starts dialing the number. And then I have my own ringtone. Which calls John's phone and plays call to the post. They can have it pretty quick. It's a big improvement over the old-fashioned way of foaling. Yeah, basically, um, you slept right outside the stall. I had a little monitor. Foals are born front feet first. John only calls a vet if he knows a mother or baby is in trouble. Once she has the baby and it comes out, and then, you, you know, then you're looking at everything. Does it have white on the body? Does it have, is there is a good solid bay? Um, are there dark legs? Is it a boy? Is it a girl? You know, so that's the... Uh, the neat part. Foals are born with no immunities. Those are in the mare's first milk, so a Clydesdale newborn doesn't get much rest. I try to get them up by three hours, and I want them nursing by four hours. Marge and Judith Ann are two of the moms to be here at Warm Springs Ranch. About 35 babies will be born here this year. These two are due in the next 10 days. I've got some actually really, really nice babies this year. I mean, and we usually always do, but I've got some that are, I, th I think are going to grow up to be really nice. And he's not even halfway through foaling season with more babies on the way. Kay Quinn, News Channel 5. Hey! <laughs> Let's not do one. No. no. no.